everyone, we're back, and hey, isn't this a surprise? This is the remake of the original Resident Evil. Now, I've played most of the games on my channel, and I do want to get all of the ones that I haven't played, at least the important ones, done before Remake 2 comes out in January, the day after my birthday, slash on my birthday, depending on exactly when it gets released. But, I never have actually played through Chris's scenario all the way through on my own in Remake. I've seen it multiple times, but I've never actually played through it. And there's the fact that I've not actually done a Let's Play of Remake technically, because Resident Evil Remake, the remake of the first game, was done as a charity stream, but I never actually went back and Let's Played it. So, yeah. The charity stream had Jill's playthrough, now we're going to play through Chris's playthrough. And I have rolled my R's really well there. And yes, I'm going to use the alternate control scheme, because guess what? You can use both. When you use the alternate control scheme, um, it means when you use the analog stick, because uh, I'm using a mouse, or mouse, <laughs> I'm using a controller. When you use the analog stick on a controller on the PC, you run around just wherever you're pointing. But if you use the directional pad, even when you're using alternate, you still move as tank controls. So that way I get the best of both worlds. Not that I have to justify myself, but you know. Like climbing a mountain fulfilling, but takes a lot of work, like going on a hike, got exercise, but not too strenuous, like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. So if I remember correctly, this is easy, medium, hard, or easy, normal, hard. So we're gonna go with normal, because I learned from my original attempt at Let's Playing Resident Evil 4. <laughs> so yay, Chris! And I have, yes, I have alternate outfits. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Mmm. Well, I think that I can switch his outfit later on. I do kinda like the BSA outfit. But let's go for the original. Gotta love the original. Gotta, 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 gotta. I really wanted to go for the BSA one, especially because I am playing through Resident Evil 5 again with Molly on Twitch. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in Please the don't desync, because this game has a notorious miss for desyncing the audio in the cutscene. Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. No, not yet, they disappeared. I don't know what happened to them. Resident Evil. Bizarre Day. murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of. You'll hurt your eyes people. if you sit that close to a TV. Victims TV. were apparently eaten. Gross. And yet, the they didn't turn into, zo into zombies. But we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo uh -oh. team's helicopter was a derelict. Does it only have vines growing inside of it? It kind of looks like it did on the windshield. The like, but it's only been there for a day. Uh oh. How did he, how was he that close to the body and he didn't notice it when he was pointed right at we it? Continued what? Our search for the other members. Hey, it's Whisker. Hey, Whisker, how you doing? turned into a nightmare. The movie dialogue. <laughs> Not as bad as the original, though. Or as good, depending on how you look at it. Hey, Jill. We're not playing as you. We're playing as Chris. <laughs> But we're gonna save you. We're gonna save your butt. Hey, Joseph. Bye, Joseph. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, what? Oh, right. Wait for it. <sighs> Bye, Joseph! <laughs> See, I count, what, two, three dogs? They destroy Joseph there. Jill misses all of her freaking shots. Yeah, okay, four dogs. There's four dogs there. Jill misses all of her freaking shots. Doesn't manage to kill one of them. Just freaking stands. I'm pretty sure there's parts of the game where you come across more dogs than that. Like, at one time. And yeah, Jill's like, oh my god, dogs. Come on. Hey, Chris. Time to run. Okay, here, here's coming up, like, the worst thing Whis Whisker has ever done. If he wants to, like, continue his plans. Wait for it. Hey, Brad. <laughs> Bye, Brad! How's it going? Fuck you guys, I'm out! <laughs> uh, 
Why would he turn around there? <laughs> See? Whisker- Yes, I'm gonna keep calling him Whisker. Whisker just saved- Saved Chris's life, okay? Also, since we're playing as Chris, we're not gonna be able to see Barry, which sucks. Because Barry- Barry is my life. He's amazing. But no Barry this playthrough. If you want to see Barry, go see the charity playthrough that I did. It's still on the channel. It's Let's, Let's Charity Stream there Remake. There are only three stars members left now. Captain Wesker, Jill, and myself. Dun, dun, dun. We don't know where Barry is. <sighs> but, yeah. Is everyone all right? Barry. Where's Barry? What was I saying? <gasps> right! Whisker could have saved himself He's so much trouble if he let Chris die there. No. <laughs> What was that? I'll go and check it out. All right. Jill and I will stay and secure this area. I mean, it takes... Chris? Okay, look at look at Jill's face here. Take care. She's totally not looking yeah. at him. <laughs> She's looking like to his far right. <laughs> I'm allowed to make fun of the game. It's old. It's a remake of a remake. Or a remaster of a remake. So this is what I mean. See, this is tank controls, right? You know, tank. I'm tanking. Tank controls. <laughs> As I make Chris go in a circle. So this is me using the directional button, despite having the alternate mode, right? This is tank controls. Cool. But if I use the joystick, whee! <laughs> Which is the reason why I like the alternate controls. I know a lot of people are like, it's not pure Resident Evil unless it's tank controls. And I'm like, well, I don't care. Hey, what's my, what's my controls? That, that's that. That's that. That the, the what's my what's my attack? Oh, there we go. There we go. That's my attack button. I can't remember if I've actually played this game with the controller because I remember usually using the mouse and keyboard. This is going to be fun. Okay, and I can yeah, I can aim. Cool. No gun for me though. <laughs> I'm not allowed to have guns because I'm Chris. I just punch boulders. I don't need guns. Nah, bruh. I just punch boulders. Best cutscene in Resident Evil history. Best cutscene in Resident Evil history. Also, that was really well animated dead body. Just like you can see all the pores on him and stuff. Bye. See you later. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Okay, bye. Whisker! You're never gonna guess what I just saw! Whisker! Whisker! Whisker and Jill Sandwich! Sounds like a comedy troupe. And they're gone. Well, shit. Whisker? Jill? Whisker obviously succumbed to his non existent wounds, turned into a zombie, and ate Jill. Where did they go? I mean, I just told you, Chris. Whisker ate Jill. I have that gun. Like, I'm not even joking, I think. Is that- Yeah, I have that gun. I straight up have that gun. Um, it's an airsoft, so it's not an actual gun gun, but I have a replica of the Star's Samurai Edge, which is this gun, on my bookshelf, right there. If you guys want to see it, I will show it to you in a video. Let me know in the comments. But I actually have a one-to-one -one replica of the Samurai Edge. It has a long and sordid history of why I actually have it. Okay. Alright, I don't have a lockpick because I'm Chris. <sighs> Fuck, I forgot about that. <sighs> Shit. Alright, oh, uh, yes, I jumped on this way. Push the ting because I need the me up. And we're gonna push it back into place so I can make myself a crimson head friend. If you guys just heard of what sounded like a monkey going ooh ooh ah ah, that was my chinchilla. <laughs> chinchillas. It was one of the chinchillas. Like, but why? Why are you making noises? Are you happy that I gave you food? Is that it? Okay, bye-bye, Chin. Okay, so you'll be good, Chins. Silly Chinchill. Oh, 
I'll be right back. And they're fine. I just had to check on my chinchillas because I'm like, why are you guys squeaking at me? Do they think I'm talking to them or something? When I'm actually, you know, talking to you guys? Well, I'm talking to nobody, actually. I'm in fact talking to myself right now. There's nobody listening. Nobody's here. You guys are going to see this for another 24-ish hours, depending on how long it takes to upload. Ah, oh, shit. Hey, like defense item. Very, no, pick up the freaking dagger, dumbass. Thank you. Time to get stabbed. And zombie. <gasps> zombie! It's a zombie. Uh-oh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do about zombie? <laughs> Buzz Amble friend. And that is my um, expertly dodge. Now, usually, if you kill him there and he turns into a crimson head, he'll be forever trapped behind this. See, even when he turns into a crimson head. Let's just make sure. Hey, zombie friend. How you doing? He's just forever trapped underneath there. Even if he turned into, turned into a crimson head and I killed him, I'm not gonna waste the bullets. He's just gonna be my friend. I'm gonna call him... Eduardo. That's Eduardo. I'm probably gonna forget his name and give him another one later, but his name for now is Eduardo. It's locked. And I'm blowing a sword. Okay. Bye, Eduardo. See you later, nerd. So everywhere is locked. Because it's a Resident Evil game, and of course everywhere is locked. It's locked. And blowing up a helmet. It... Oh, classic Resident Evil bullshit locking mechanisms on everything. At least this isn't locked. Even though I don't think there's anything I can actually do here because I need the pair, I need the, the arrow. To do the stuff here. Yeah, I need the arrow to do stuff here. There's a special arrow that I need to get from a place with the thing, and then I can get in there. If I remember correctly, that is in the stairway of the eventual Crimson Head. <laughs> That's the official name I'm giving it. The stair- or, well, it's not a stairway. Let's, let's go find Rebecca, I think. I think I can find Rebecca. I don't know if I can find Rebecca at this point or if it's later. But I think I know the, I know the room where you meet Rebecca in the original game. There's Amba gonna be here. Okay, now. Good. Let's lock from the other side. Well, this one's not- Oh, wait, yes it is. Shit! Okay, so we need to get the sword key. Where do I get the sword key from? I don't know, but I need this. There's a zombie here. Yep. Hi, Zombie. Come here. I'm gonna lead you to paradise! Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do! Come on, follow the ju Juicy Chris Flesh. He hasn't taken steroids yet, so he's much healthier meat. Might not, he might not taste as good after he takes all those steroids before Resident Evil 5, though. Okay, come on. I'm gonna call you Jaredine. I don't even know if that's a name, but your name is Jaredine. Doom. Doom. And where do I get the sword key from? Because I I straight up don't remember <laughs> where you get the sword key from. I can't do the emblem stuff yet. Stupid camera angles! Okay, Jardine! Jardine, I'm over here. Okay, never mind. He already went that way. Bye, Jardine. See you later. <laughs> And yes, I'm going to kill the least amount of zombies as possible, because that's how Resident Evil should be played. Okay? The least- the least amount of trouble possible. Uh, this is locked. Okay, yeah. Let's talk from the other side. It's locked. Armor key. It's locked. Sword key. So I go back this way. Yes. 
It's been a hot minute since I played this game, and again, I've never actually myself finished Chris Scenario. I've gotten really far in Chris's Scenario, but I really don't remember ever actually beating it. And they just need to open. Hey, what? Two halves of each run the other through the path. Oh, right, it's the painting thing. But I can't do anything to it until I get the correct emblem. I think is how that works. I'm pretty sure. Hey, can I hear Jardine up there? I think I do hear Jardine up there. Oh, there's a zombie in here. Ah, crap. <laughs> ah, crap. He's up north of me, though. Hi! I don't like you. You're an asshole. Back from the other side. I'm just gonna... Yeah. The corpse of your comrade, Kenneth. It looks like he's holding something. A thing! I would rather... He have ammunition like he did in the original game. Because in the original game, he had ammo. <laughs> And I want ammo. <laughs> hey, Chris. How you doing? He looks so much better before the steroids. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just a step to the... No, it's just a step to the... Right. Put your hands on your hips. And tuck your knees inside. And do the perfect dance. <laughs> It'll drive you insane. Let's do the star dance again! Okay, I'm done. <laughs> or am I? <laughs> okay. No, I'm done. Oh, I like zombie. Oh, I like drugs. I don't need it. I'll get them later. Another annoying thing about playing as Chris is the fact that you have less, uh... I have slots. Which sucks! This has eight and Chris has six. Oh, fudge nugget. Well, there's the crimson hat on the floor. Suck from the other side. Oh, fudge. Uh. Bye! <gasps> there it is! Yoink! Gimme. Oh, and I have to get out of here. Okay, there's gonna be a zombie. Oh! Wait, what? I swear there was another zombie in here. Okay. <laughs> I'm misremembering. No, I know there was two zombies in there during my Jill playthrough. Hi, Geraldine. How you doing? Or is it Geraldine? Geraldine. That's what it was. Uh, what's my inventory button? There we go. Uh, examine. That's what it was. <laughs> oh. At least I can be removed and yoink! Arrowhead is made from perio. Some prefer to use the poor man's emerald. It's also my mother's birthstone. True back. It is my mother's birthstone. Mine, however, is garnet. Because I was born in January. Now this needs to go all the way back into the graveyard so we can get into the super scary Crimson Head section. With the Crimson Head we're not fighting yet. Even though he's a jerk. And I just pump him full of shotgun rounds. Oh, I'm gonna have to wait to get the shotgun, because I can't use Barry and his Jill sandwich to get me the shotgun. Balls. Everything's better with Barry. I mean, I like Rebecca. Wait, there's no zombies out here? This is Rang! This is Rang! <laughs> I, was, I remember there being two zombies out here! This is the the ship of Narrowhead. We need to use the thing! And go down and see some of the best lighting effects I've ever seen in a video game. Seriously, this game is gorgeous. It is so well made. And this isn't just because of the um, HD remaster. It's a remaster. It's not a remake of a remake. This shadowing here? 
That's totally just what they did with the GameCube. Also, glitchiness. Oh my god, it's still just... Okay, um, I've had enough of messing around with Chris. The book is fitted perfectly into the indentation. Will you take the Book of Curses? Sure. <laughs> Cause that seems like a good idea. Oh, I like a key. It's key better than that cover. Will you remove it? Yes. Got the mansion key. Book of Curses and... Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that see speaks no evil, a mask that smells no evil, a mask that sees no evil, a mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When the four fall into place, evil will awaken. Which is obviously, like, the coffin above me. Brilliant. Which key is this? Oh good, the sword key. Let's go see Rebecca. Because <laughs> now I think I can see Rebecca. I think. I, I don't actually know what the trigger for seeing Rebecca is. But I also know that the room that you find Rebecca in, I think, if it's the room that I'm thinking of, is a safe room with an item box so I can put the freaking knife away. Because nobody uses the knife! Unless they're doing a knife only run. Then they use the knife. Okay, let's go see Geraldine. I know Geraldine is a name. But I gave him the name Geraldine. Even if that's not a name, that is now a name. I've decided this. As a thing. It is a name. <laughs> okay, Geraldine, how you doing? Oh fuck! Tell me, Geraldine, no! Rude. Geraldine, you're an asshole. Of course I went the way the Geraldine was. I should have paid more attention, but I didn't, and then I almost got eaten by a zombie. Damn zombies. Okay. Okay. Zombies. Oh, zombie! <laughs> Bye, zombie! Rebecca, are you in here? Is she not? Um. Okay? <laughs> oh, um. There's a handgun magazine. Now I can get rid of this crap. Uh, and this crap. Okay, I'm gonna find Becca. Or figure out where Becca's supposed to be. Because Becca's supposed to be somewhere, but I don't know how to put the Becca in this game. And it's also been 25 minutes since I started recording this, and I know that's a little bit shorter than I normally do, but I do need to get some videos exporting quick. So, my name is Miss Guy the Tanager, and I have been playing some Resident Evil Remake Chris Scenario, and I'll see you all in the next video.